Welcome to my channel. My name is Vanessa Woods. I'm going to show you an eyebrow tutorial today. I actually got a lot of requests from the last videos that I've posted of people asking, how do you do your brows? So that's what I'll show you. As you can see, I do not have thick brows at all. When I was in high school, it was in to have that really thin line of an eyebrow. So I plucked and plucked and plucked and plucked and plucked and I've just destroyed their natural growth. They don't even know where to come in anymore. They, so I fill them in. I use this brow conditioning primer by Benefit. Really, really like this primer. I would highly recommend it, especially anyone that has the same problem that I have and it's the thin eyebrows that are kind of sparse. Um, and what this primer will do is kind of act like a brow gel a little bit and it's shaped like this and you give it a pump and you brush your eyebrow hairs exactly how you want them to stay. But you want to do this primer before you put any product on your eyebrows, so bare brows. And so if you can see, I brush it forward in the front, brush it up, and then as I get deeper into my brow, I start brushing it diagonally and you just play around with them with the primer until you're happy with how they're laying. When you prime it this way, it helps a lot for when you're going in with your product to be able to follow that eyebrow hair pattern. And you only need one click. It literally says it on the tube. One click per brow of this primer, so it's really not much. Now, what I use for a product and I have been using this for years. I mean, if, if they discontinue this product, I don't know what I'm gonna do for my face. But this Anastasia Eyebrow Pomade, this color is dark brown. I normally get the ebony. So I've got my pomade and I also have this very skinny, sharp eyebrow brush. It's important that it's very skinny. It'll help you make your eyebrow hairs look realer. So you want it real nice and sharp and you want it clean. You always want to start out with a clean brush. So what I do is go in with my brush. I'm going to grab a little product and then I use the top of the brow pomade and kind of just wipe some off in there and sharpen it. Now it's really important that you do not bear down hard. You don't want to start at the very beginning of your eyebrow when you're first applying the product because your first swipe is going to be when you have the most product on the brush. So start a little bit towards the inner middle part of your eyebrow. It'll help so that you can transition into the front and make it look realistic. So here we'll go right about right here and short hair like wispy swipes across your brow. When I notice that it's looking not as sharp as I wanted, I just go in and grab the product again the same way. So I like a straight line right here. And then I follow my natural arch and bring it down with the hair that I have in my brow. All right, so our bottom line is done. So now what I'll do, grab a little more product, same thing, keep the brush nice and sharp. Now I'll go in at the top same thing, not too close to the front of the brow. Following my natural arch, I'll bring it back down. Okay, so without adding extra product to the brush, now I'm going to start creating the beginning of the brow. Just give it a line at the bottom. And then I'm going to flick it up. I'm holding the brush this way, and I'm going to use the bottom of it and flick the product up like hair. Following the eyebrow hair, how we brush the eyebrow hair using the primer. So I need a little more product. When I feel like I have enough product right here up in the front, that's when I spin the eyebrow brush around and use the spoolie end and just brush it up.
And if you still have a couple of patches that you feel like you need to fill in, go ahead and very lightly do that. So like right here, I want it a little more full. Right here at the bottom, so I don't really have hair there. I give it a little bit more dimension by just tapping the product there to make it thicker so that it resembles that hair is poking out. Does that make sense? And same thing, just keep brushing through it until you're happy with it. All right, so I am happy with that eyebrow. So look at the difference. This is my natural brow. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Blessed Brow. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing, kind of, to the other brow. So again, I'm gonna start about right here. So I'm happy with the shape. What I've heard that I absolutely love and agree with is eyebrows are not twins, they're sisters. So it don't get caught up on if they don't look exactly the same. Exactly the same looks fake. They're not twins, they're sisters. What else I do, honestly I don't do this every single time, but since this is an eyebrow video and we're expected to be on fleek, I'm gonna show you my extra step to clean them up and just get them exactly how you want them. Um, but again, when I'm running late for work, I'm like, all right, looks good, let's go. So if you want extra fleekness, we're gonna go in and use some concealer just to clean it up a little bit. So this is my concealer that I use everywhere else on my face, under my eyes. I have a brush that I can get nice and sharp and I'm going to take some concealer on my brush. I'm even gonna use my hand because we don't want a lot of concealer. Just a little bit will be enough to erase what we don't need there um, and it'll still be easy to blend it back in a little bit. So, because you do not want a highlighter line underneath your eyebrow. I'm sorry if you do that, but I think it looks stupid. All right, so here we go. Same as before, you don't wanna start right here. Start it right about here. All right, so now I'll go to the front. Okay, and make sure you blend this out. For Christ's sake. That is one of my biggest pet peeves. Leaving it like, okay, girl, we good. No, you're not. You're not. You skipped a step. For Christ's sake. I don't do anything right here. Do not box it in. You don't want to do that. I don't really do much up top right here unless I've really like royally screwed it up and I need to erase it. Um, but I think we're good today. But every now and then I will sharpen right up here. And if you flucked up a little bit and got concealer up into your eyebrow when you don't want it there, just go back with your eyebrow brush and do that. Okay, so we got the right eyebrow on fleek. Same thing to the left side.
All right, and that's how I do my brows. I think we're pretty good. They look like sisters, not twins. Um, so I'm happy with them. And now I'm gonna continue the rest of my makeup. Let me know if you have any questions. Feel free to leave them below. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Click that little bell so that you can keep up with what I am pumping out there. Thanks so much. Bye.